Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is Mr. Mokolover, and let's continue playing as that new California Republic. So right now, we're at War with the Rapids, and I just woke up. Um, yeah. Let's go ahead and kick some butt, but first, we got a little bit of political power to spend. So, let's see. War propaganda for more weekly war support. That could be nice. Mobilize the people. Not really nice. Uh, we could, we definitely need a scavenge for stuff. Scavenge options. Huh. Anything else? No. Alright. Internal sphere. Consumer tech. Well, we only have 58 stability because we're at war. Let's go ahead. Uh, I want the weekly war support. I really do. I don't want anything less than 50%. But supply. Ooh. Hmm. Special Forces Capacity Multiplier would be good. Oh, I, I like all these. Designers. Designers are okay. I mean, they have 10% research boost. They're alright, you know. So, let's go ahead and do some of this. Let's go ahead and get the Weekly War Support. Followed up with scavenging for stuff. Now, someone did comment saying I should go for Power Armor. I totally will. Just give me time. I will eventually get down there. I probably won't use it an extreme amount. But I will still get it. Let's see, for this... Ooh. I don't want to do this yet because I lose planning speed, defense, and max planning. Ooh, roll out technology to scavengers. Huh. Moat tries scavenging decisions. Interesting. Actually, that's not bad. Lost vehicle, robot scavengers, search for equipment. Uh, we could try that. A little bit faster research speed for 50 days. Yeah, I mean, that might, that might not be bad, actually. Let's go and do that. So right now, I'm trying to break through enemy lines here in the Mojave. Or no, this is just the Rapids. The Mojave's a little further north, I guess, technically. Is it? I don't know. I don't know my geography very much. Oh, we got to get all the way to Tumble Home. And yes, I can invite dead horses, but... You know? You know, as pretty as this person might be, I don't think it'd be very good for us to get involved with this conflict, especially if I can't fight for them or fight with them against dead horses. Because they're fighting the crazy horns, so. Alright, let's see. We are slowly, slowly winning the battle. Oh, and they just added more infantry there. Is there anywhere else I can exploit, maybe, perhaps? Gamma cores. Oh yeah, we got these special units last time. 68 for that. Are these exactly the same? It looks like they're exactly the same. 68 soft attack, organization's 49. Oh, but the infantry is... has way less HP, huh. It's more soft attack, more defense, and more breakthrough, so those are okay. Yeah, we probably want to stop our rangers from attacking at this point, so go ahead and do that. Because now the rapids are just going to keep attacking and attacking and attacking. Actually, if I attack to the right, that might prove to be better. Yeah, actually, I'll probably do that instead. Cool. More infantry. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, they're attacking us quite quite a bit. Let's get them some motorized down here. Just in case. <clears throat> they really don't like it that we're here. And that's okay. That's definitely okay. Alright, I mean, just keep attacking me, guys. I mean, yeah, I suffered 307 casualties. Not good for our manpower. I will try to increase the amount of manpower we do have, but they suffered over 1.4 thousand, so that's not too bad. Smoke signals, better reinforce rate, decryption, encryption, ooh, ooh. These only take, like, 100 days of Mac combined. Encryption, decryption, I'll do that first. Alright, I mean, they just keep attacking us. Oh, someone actually got, has to retreat. Oh, one of the rangers has to retreat. But this is good experience for Lieutenant Gordobets, so... Oh, we were actually pushed out of there. All right, give me these four. And come over here. What is the manpower? Okay, so they got still quite a bit of manpower left. Good. I'm going to give my guys just a tiny bit more time. Oh, wait, they need anti-tank. I'm not making any anti-tank. Uh, do that. Take you off by... Do that. We'll do that for now. I could really use some anti-tank. So, 
Looks like they're not doing super well either. Let's see if we can actually push this direction. Cut these guys off. Give them extra little push, like force attack. Oh, good, 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 good. Nice. Very nice. Send one of you guys up here to help. Oh, not that way. Do this way. Nice. Very good, very good. <clears throat> Ranger reorganization. More soft attack, hard attack, and defense. Oh, awesome. That's where we get this. Cool. Alright, so... We could do Mojave Outpost. Rebuilding the Long 15. Ranger Propaganda. <clears throat> Let's probably do that. Because I just want to make a jump for it as fast as possible to the Beacon of Democracy. But then eventually we want to get Mojave subjug Subjugation. Which requires one of these two. Let's do Ranger Population. Oh, we got some more uh, political power. Nice. Rolling out technologies. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, let's actually get something else this time. Uh, you know what? I'm not sure if there's a way for me. If I can um, see how many divisions or how many battalions I can make as special forces. Because right now, I can't really see. Nine. Oh, there we go. And training zero out of our 49 allowed. So we're allowed 49, which is actually not too bad. That's not too bad, actually. Hmm. Maybe I'll just continue to increase the size of these, maybe, perhaps? Oh, we need more machine guns, probably. Um, because I was thinking about increasing the number I can actually use. But, division organization, supply consumption. Supply consumption, I think, is going to be very, very useful. Just because the infrastructure all around here is going to be really bad. Like, pretty bad. Um, yeah, 10% is okay. It's not terrible, but... You know, let's go with Colonel Tsu. Tsu, Tsu. Let's do that first. Because right now we could be suffering some attrition right here. And we want to mitigate as much attrition as possible. So nice, very nice. <clears throat> oh. One motorized division is defending. What is the 20 combat width? Can they pierce me? No, they can't pierce. Wow. With one single APC battalion I threw into these motorized divisions. They can't pierce me. That's awesome. That's really awesome, actually. Uh, let's see. Ranger General Mossman. Doral Does anyone have upgrades? Sue? James? Sue? Nope. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Like I said, I just kind of didn't exactly just wake up, but well, I woke up within the past half hour. Cool. So we got guys all around. Let's take the supply base, if we can. Someone got from a loss. Algodons. Algodons. Cool. Ooh. More infantry good. I mean, y'all, these are just your standard infantry. Very nice. Decode symbols. Symbols. Signals. Ooh, I can't speak this morning. Cor coordinated assault. More breakthrough good. I like more breakthrough. <clears throat> Alright, so I gotta take a stop here. <coughs> Mechanized warfare or trooper warfare. So, this will give us more organization for infantry, motorized, mechanized, more soft attack, and a little more supply use. Max infantry speed, which is okay. Tanks breakthrough armor, max speed, and supply use. Supply use. So, that actually will increase how many supplies they need. And then we get more soft attack, hard attack, supply use, and organization. Compared to more defense for leg infantry and entrenchment speed. More heart attack, which is okay. Not great. Supply use. I don't really use militias. Supply use goes down quite a bit. That's not bad. That's better for supply use. Better leg infantry recovery rate and reinforce rate. We get 5% more recruitable population, but we lose organization. I don't really want to lose organization, but 5% sounds pretty good. And more recon, more soft attack, and heart attack. Ooh, this is hard. I like both. I don't like the losing organization, but you do get 5% more population, which we could probably use quite a bit. Here, um, in total, how much soft attack do we get with mechanized warfare? So we get 5% plus 10% total for soft attack. On this side, we get more defense, a little more heart attack. We really don't get any more soft attack. We get 5%. This side gives us 10% soft attack, 
This side gives us 5%, but it gives us 5% more recruitable population. So, as much as I want to do the left one, I think I'm going to go with the right. Yeah, I'm going to go with the right one. Even though we lose organization, 5%. I mean, yeah, 5% isn't a big deal, but I just got plus 7.5% organization. So, I'm feeling that's, that's probably worth it. That's probably worth it. Besides, my infantry are just going to be hopefully here for mostly defense. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Nice. Take a supply base. Love it. Thank you very much, guys. Lead with the rangers. Lead with the rangers. More organization. Yes, please. Actually, do you have goals to do that? Cool. Just kind of hang out. They're going to keep attacking you. Uh, send in the motorized. Warrior training. Very nice. More defense. More breakthrough. Mm, let's go ahead and get that other... Can't do that yet. This research speed, or what was that? Yeah, research speed, cool. Yeah, I just don't want to attack yet. I mean, they're attacking us. Let them tire themselves out. Let them panic. Let them screech. Let them yell. We're desert foxes now, which I love. All right, it's time to put them out of their misery. Go ahead, Rangers. You probably can just do, do this by yourself. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Good job, guys. Notice that we haven't even attacked up here yet. Do we have enough political power for... Ooh, more scavenging options. Scavenge for vehicles using vehicles. Hmm. Still doing that. Weekly war support. Well, it's going up by one. If I lose stability... Weekly war support goes down, no. Oh, wait, you get... Effects when selected, you gain 20% more, but you lose more and more war support. Hmm, interesting. What are we building currently? We could probably use more military factories, honestly. Oh, don't do that. Do it right there. Nice. Oh, wait, don't do it there. Do it right there. Now that's good. That's good stuff. Now we're cooking. Awesome. So, let's go ahead and attempt another attack. Can you guys make it over here? Oh, you guys actually can. Don't attack yet. Don't attack yet. Cool. While well, my guys get a little more planning before we actually do attack. Let's see, stockpile. We need more anti tank, which we're working on. We need more close air support and fighter equipment. How is that going? I know I'm taking this a little slow. Like I've said before, I'm pretty new to the mod, and I just want to make sure I don't make too many mistakes, even though taking your time in this case might actually might be a mistake. So, Dead Horse says no thanks. I don't think you've really changed your position very much. Yeah, you've lost more and more land. Sorry, guys. Don't really... Not really interested in that. Cool. All right, so they're pretty much ready. To, yeah, pretty much ready. More max speed. Very nice. Even more max speed. Supply use. Ooh. Vehicle's max speed goes down, but you get more armor. Hmm. Less max speed. More. Oh, wait. Ve vehicles are infantry. Motorized and infantry. Um, that actually might not be bad, but is there anything else? Support equipment, I'll probably, yeah, I probably will add on these healing powder field hospital thingies, though. So. See, preparation for the attack. What if I tell you to move? Ranger propaganda. That was over here. Nice, more population. Mm, basic power armor. That'd be interesting to start building that. Let's go with Old World Wisdom just so that we can get more bonus right now. What if I gave you a little extra boost and told one of you guys to also help out? Yeah, there we go. Four divisions versus four divisions. Troll Warns, Declared Warm, Bone Pickers. Bone Pickers. Where are the Bone Pickers? Oh, that's something else. Painted Men. Probably up north. Oh, there they are. Troll Warns. Oh. Oh, it's just Seattle, probably. Or Oregon, actually. Yeah. Portland, Oregon, probably. There's always problems going on up there. Awesome. Encoded signals. Great. More encryption. Plus zero. Well, that was a waste. <laughs> plus zero. Oh, no. Uh, let's see. Purification stations. Honestly, we're okay on resources, so don't need to worry about that just yet. Probably we'll have to worry about it later. Ships? I mean, honestly, our sh I think our ships are doing pretty fine right now. I don't think we're really in a conflict with any ship peoples. 
You can't... Oh, Savaged Bomber. Salvaged Bomber. Ooh, what is the range? 2,500 comp... Actually, the Dive Bomber's range is better than the Savaged... Salvaged Fighter. Weird enough. Robotics? Well, I'm gonna use Power Armor. Probably not use those too much. Oh, we get more max speed here. Max speed, more armor. I'll do that first. Why not? Cool. So, we made it across. Having a good time. Don't move. Don't... Oh, you already moved a little bit. That's fine. I want you all over here, and I want you to try to take this tiny spot, because then we can encircle the rest of these guys, and then probably have some major push this way. So, Ah, oh, Goro Betts, you're doing a great job, man. Doing a great, great job. Oh, he's almost level 4. Ooh, more infantry? Nice. Hmm. We have 54 political power. Explosive support would hurt us. NCR troopers. <clears throat> oh, they could probably add on explosive support. Looks like it just gives us debuffs. I don't like that. So right now, we're probably not going to do that. Anti-tank is actually pretty good. More heart attack is pretty awesome. Because I have heard that if you use laser guns, that actually reduces your... Or you're not able to pierce power armor, especially if you fight the Brotherhood of Seal, which I don't want to. But I heard laser guns actually do that and that's not really cool so all right guys you should be able to take these guys out pretty easily we got air support they're using malicious it looks like for the most part at least that's the symbol for them they're a little bit entrenched but my rangers they're pretty good guys nice and we've done it who done it and they're panicking ah oh, yes go ahead and teach them to not panic anymore uh send half you guys up here send another one in that this direction send you one this way Get the motorized. Make sure no one can break through. Good, 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 good. Let them panic. More infantry. Sure, I'll take them. I'll probably start building up another army just because I don't know where anyone else will really attack us. Wow, ten divisions here. Uh, send one ranger division as well. Awesome. Cool. And don't move. Okay, so they abandoned the line. So I'm just going to go ahead and tell you all. Come up here. Have a good time. Your goal is to literally just spearhead up through, the, through here. Go right ahead. Don't want to take too many more casualties, but... I think we'll be doing okay. I really do think we'll be okay. <clears throat> if needed, use these guys as a backdrop to hold the line as our infantry just keep moving up. Wow, 13 divisions in one place. That might be a little bit too much. And they didn't even do anything. Thank you very much, the Rapids. I appreciate your contributions to our war effort. So now we're at peace once again. 155 political power. Let's go ahead. Oh, that's a nice amount of war support, finally. Let's see. I can lose some guns, some scrap gun trucks. Scrap gun trucks, which is APC and motorized. That's okay if we lose some of them right now. Let's see. We get lost contact, vehicle, scavengers return. Um, If we do scavenge for vehicles, we lose manpower. It doesn't look like we get any of the, any of the manpower back. Or I guess that's for everything. What do we need? Well, I need stuff. Vehicles? Let's search, let's search for vehicles. Why not? Let's see what happens. Awesome. Cool. More infantry. Great. <clears throat> so, I guess... Oh, we're almost done with our... Uh, focus. Now, since we're not at war, I want to keep pushing for war with other people before we get into any extremely major conflict. So... Who would we go against? Probably the Mojave Raiders, which are over here. I've probably given them way too much time to build themselves up. Actually, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and do... Nipton gets outposts. What's the infrastructure like around here? Nipton has two. Long 15 has... F oh, five. That's pretty good. Long 15... There he is five. Nipton has two. Let's go with the outposts then. 
Free dockyards. I'm just building ships. I'm not sure where to, what to do with them. I think we got enough convoys. Mm, go and build this for now. Place this in the bone yard. As we kind of let time go on. So apparently we've got... Ooh. So the super heavy barge is obviously a battleship. So I'm feeling okay about this. I mean, it looks, it looks okay to me. But, you know... I don't know. Just slap you on here. So we got a lot of light cruisers. These sailing ships are light cruisers. That's what I kind of figured. And... Out... Rig Outrigger Canoe 1 are just destroyers. Cool. Nice, we got a full army here now. So, I'm not going to use everyone here, obviously. Colonel Missandra? Mis no. Cassandra, not Missandra. Out of supply bonus, Desert Fox, Infantry Expert. She's becoming a very, very good general. I want to say, though, I want to use Hanlon for this next part just because he needs maybe a little bit more experience. Maybe he needs some sort of trait. So I'm going to go ahead and station all of you guys here. I probably need to increase the infrastructure over here, too. Um, if I had to strike first, it might be... Searchlight. Yeah, we'll do that. This is probably going to kill the supply here. So, let's go ahead and increase... Infrastructure just a little bit. Oh, and... 50 is not bad. We'll do that, too. Awesome. I'm getting hungry. Ooh. Heart attack. Sure, why not? Cool. Let everyone move around. I'm... Okay. How many divisions do they have? 104. Oh, boy. 12 divisions at a time. I have, like, 50-some. Let's do that. Rangers, can I increase... Uh, I have four ranger divisions. If I increase it by like four each at 16, I can only have, add like 39 more for special forces. Oh wait, 61. Up to 61. So I've got 25 I can use. 25 divided by four is six. I can add in six more battalions in total. Um, For right now, just I'll go ahead and add in another spec ops. A little more supply use, a little less piercing, a little more weight, whatever. A little more combat width, but you get more defense, more soft stack, a little more soft stack at least. Go ahead and do that for now. And that puts us at... Already at a 61. Awesome. Cool. Um, it's... I don't even know what I'm researching yet, so I'm going to wait for this last one, because I love Special Forces Capacity Multiplier, but War Support Planning Speed is not bad, Wait and See is not bad. And American Badass isn't bad either. Planes. I kind of like the planes. I really do. Attack Bomber. Well, I don't see anything for close air support. This might be it, but it's probably Naval Bombers. Let's go with Fighters. Awesome. Let's go ahead and start building up another army. Just in case. So, right here is an area that we could... Oh my gosh, that's a lot of divisions. All I'm worried about right now is a potential war with Kaisar's Legion. They seem pretty strong. Fairly strong. Not gonna lie. Dynamite, I've heard, is pretty good. Don't know if I really want to use it, though. Explosive support. Uh, let's see. Soft attack is pretty nice. I kind of want to do signal companies, though, because I've heard they're pretty not bad. Oh, but logistics. I might have to go with logistics. Oh, my gosh. It's so hard to choose. There's so many options. So many things you could do. Oh. Let's go ahead and throw on some... Oh, yeah, that's that's nice. Trickle back. XP loss goes down. A little more HP. Go ahead and do that. For Rangers, I might do the same just because... At least for now... I don't want to lose my Rangers since I'm using them so... So much. Go ahead and do that. They only get better and better, so... And now we're probably going to need a lot of support equipment. Y'all got yeah. Put you up here. Pipe gun, machine guns. Nice. Do that. Nice. Get up to 20. Cool. For you guys. Cassandra more. Um, I hate how there's individual like front lines you can make here. So just do this for now. Just in case. And we're starting for supplies up here. So. But the rangers aren't. 
Lovely. Uh, take about half of you guys. No, I'll start with three. Come to long 15. Go and move out there. Slowly get rid of some of these divisions that are within there, just because... Well... Oh, we can't really do really good supply stuff here either. Bad supply. Great. Give me one of these as well. This bottleneck really isn't good. Um, go ahead and move yourself somewhere else. So this guy, this way you aren't suffering too much attrition. Give me this other gamma unit. I really don't know how good they are, but we'll see what happens eventually someday. And then, give me you as well. Do not want to suffer attrition whatsoever. And it's not like these guys are going to be extremely hard to beat, probably, so... Give me you too, and do that. Nice. That should help improve the situation. And this is why I definitely want more log logistic companies. Okay, so they're looking better now. Uh, go ahead and train. Sky Reavers declared war on Sky Legs or something. That sounds like it would be up north, but... Yeah, it's definitely got to be up north here. Troll Warrens, vacuum tubes. Oh, well, it doesn't really matter where they are. Better reinforce rate. I think that sounds like a pretty good thing. Dead horses. Are you still you're still alive? Wow, you're fighting all oh, you're fighting over a river. That's that's not good. Oh. White legs, sky reavers. Oh, can I go to war with these guys? No, I need I can only go to war without I my focus. God dang it. I lost contact. Today, we've heard little to nothing. From our scavenging party. A relatively normal occurrence, except today is the tenth day in a row we've heard or had no contact. <clears throat> we have their last reported location, so we could send a search party to, or to the location and try to get them back. Though this would take some organization, or we could leave them to our fate. <clears throat> We're not going to leave any man behind, alright? Or any woman behind. Mm -mm. We ain't about that. Nice. Outpost. Let's go ahead and get next to them raiders. Ooh. Well, we scavenged, tried to scavenge for vehicles last time. It didn't work out so well, so... Mm. Let's go for some equipment this time. Oh, even four more divisions. Nice. Uh, I could use a new commander, yeah. Philip Papas. Oh, nice. Nice armor guy. Nice armor. Hanlon, you're doing all right. Um, we're not going to be at war with Nipton yet, the Raiders, so we can keep doing this for a little bit. A little more army XP, and so that these guys can become at least, what was it, veterans? Regulars, not veterans, that, that wouldn't make any sense. Support equipment, nice. Oh, we're done with the infrastructure up in the long 15. That's great. Oh, now you're suffering from... Oh, no, you're training. Okay, so that's why. I'm like, I put you over here for a reason, so you wouldn't suffer supply issues, but I'm training them. I can't read. So, yeah, whatever. Cool. Alright, so that's pretty much all I think all of the time we have for today. I will let you know, today was the last day for the next three days that I can actually respond to comments. So, regardless, keep leaving your comments below. I really enjoy reading them. Ooh, there goes a couple more Mexican guys, I guess. But uh, regardless, I've got to end it here today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. We took out the Rapids. Next time, we're going to go with, to war with the Mojave Raiders. It'll be a lot of fun. Cool stuff is going to happen. Stuff that I don't know what will happen, but it's going to be fun regardless. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow as we continue to abuse the crap out of our rangers. I love them.